Hello there! In this short tutorial, I will show you how to add breaks to your Word document on Microsoft Word for Mac 2011 as a part of thesis formatting. Before we begin, make sure to activate Show All Non-Printing Characters on the standard toolbar, which will allow us to see paragraph markers and breaks. A page break is used to denote the end of a page and is useful for keeping headings attached to the text. To insert a page break, position the cursor at the start of a line. Open the Insert menu, click Break, and click Page Break. Notice that the line becomes the first line of the very next page. A section break behaves the same way, except it is used to denote the end of a chapter or to change page orientation. Once again, move the cursor to the start of the next chapter and open insert, click break, and click section break. Notice that there are other kinds of section breaks, but we will only use the one that says next page. Sometimes you may want to change the orientation of a few pages from portrait to landscape. The different orientations can coexist in the same document with the help of section breaks. Simply insert a section break at the start of the landscape section and another towards the end. Open the Layout tab under Page Setup, click Orientation, and click Landscape to make the change. Using page breaks in place of a section break and vice versa may produce unexpected results, so be familiar with their usage.